2017 is the 150th anniversary of Canada, the 125th anniversary of the Stanley Cup, and the 100th anniversary of the NHL. So it's a good time to reflect on the nature of Canada's national game. Our museum has never done an exhibition just on hockey itself, so we really want to be part of the national conversation and reflect on the meaning of the sport for Canadians. My favorite artifact in the exhibition is probably the first one that visitors will see. We call it the Moffat Stick. It dates to the 1830s and it's from Cape Breton, Nova Scotia. We know that it belonged to a little boy named Dilly Moffat because we can see his initials carved in the stick. What's really interesting about this artifact is that it's carved in a Mi'kmaq style, so it shows an indigenous influence. And for me, this tells us what we want to know about hockey in Canada, which is that it has multiple influences. It has cross-cultural relevance and it has a transnational history. So it sets the tone for what we want to do with this project. The exhibition builds a case for why hockey is Canada's game. So I want visitors when they leave to be able to answer the question, you know, why does hockey matter to Canadians? And so we make our case working our way through each zone of the exhibition, from the history of the game, to the locker room where we learn about equipment, behind the bench with coaches, and then on center ice with Team Canada. For me, it all culminates in the last section of the exhibition where we see hockey's role in Canadian popular culture. We see art, music, film, table hockey games, and hockey activism. And all of these factors, for me, prove that hockey is more than just a game. It matters off the ice. And that's really what makes hockey unique in Canada.